Welcome to TechBrothers with Amir. In this video, we are going to learn how to get identity column values without mentioning identity column name in select query. So let's go ahead and open SSMS SQL Server Management Studio, connect to the SQL Server instance, and then choose a database and open a new query. So let's say this is the database TechBrothers IT new query and here if i will go to the customer table i don't really see that if identity property is enabled or not one way i was telling in the next uh, last video if i right click here go script as and uh, create to new query i will be able to see okay customer id is the column where identity is uh, uh, present so but if uh, even i am interested to know if identity is enabled on this one or not uh, before i go uh, and uh, generate a script and all that i can use uh, select and uh, dollar sign identity from table so if the identity column will be there uh, we'll get all the values for that uh, column by using dollar sign identity if uh, there would be no identity we'll get some error so let's see uh, if we execute we see that it is returning us a uh, customer id and uh, the values uh, that means uh, customer id is the identity column and uh, these are the values uh. now if uh, i will go ahead and use uh, uh, let's say employee from here and let's see if there is any identity it does tell us okay employee id is identity but there are no values uh. now let me go ahead and uh, use the total sale so I'm trying to find a, a table where we don't have a identity column. So here in the total sale, we do not have identity column. I'm going to go ahead and uh, verify that. Right click on the total sale, script has create new query, and we see there is no identity column or property is defined on any column. So just uh, one quick way to find if identity column uh, is present, you can always use a dollar sign identity and then from the table that will give you uh, the if it returns the results it means uh, the identity a property is enabled on that column also it will return you the values and if it will throw you error it means uh, there is no identity column present in that table so thanks very much for watching this video and uh, i will see you guys in the next video